welcome back to another man cave video another city update we're getting a few changes done a few bits more added like we've been meaning to do for a while i keep saying we 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 it's only me but two things so far to start this video off so here is my new train station doesn't exactly look the bee's knees but that's pretty cool. We've got the stairs to go up, barricades to make sure you can not fall off. You've got a clock, you've got a map, you've got a ridge, the train lines up nicely. Obviously I've got to make new trains. You've got a nice little see-through roof with a pattern. I've found out I've got different styles on my uh, label maker, so I've tested that one out for now. Could make it pop a bit more, I suppose. But not only have I done that so far, we finally have Man Cave done with a little exclamation mark. That looks absolutely epic. So, with the train station and the Man Cave sign done so far, let's see what else i can get done right so i wasn't very keen on the purple so i've changed that up and we now have a dark gray edge so that makes it a little bit better still got that step up to get to the step i think i might just elevate one plate up underneath the red and then that should be that sorted and just like that looks a hell of a lot better so now you've at least got a step up to get onto the step of the train i really really need to redo these trains though they are driving me potty so we do have some orders on the way from aliexpress so we've got a pool hall slash pizza place come in we've got a um, we've got a lego truck delivery truck come in uh what else have i ordered i've got a single decker bus because obviously i've got the tour bus i've got bus stops but i want to have an actual bus got some power rangers come in and a few other little bits so i am looking forward to them coming but in the meantime need to add some figures yes i've seen people commenting yeah self-driving cars you've heard of but never self-driving bikes because I haven't added many figures yet, but that did make me laugh. That was quite funny. So I'm going to try and add a few mini figures onto here. Wait until you see the draw. So this draw set alone has a lot of mini figures in. We've got all different types of Star Wars. We've got uh, what's that? Bounty Hunters, I'm not really a massive Star Wars fan. We've got Troopers, more Troopers. We've got some little Yodas and some cows. I think a lot of these are like Mandalorian stuff. It's not from the films that I actually know. <coughs> and we've got more in this drawer. So I've got all like the Jedi stuff. So I'm assuming if it's got a lightsaber, it's some sort of a Jedi but I've got a load of those in there. I even got some Jaja Binks. And then in the bottom one is a load of Ninjago. So I've got good guys, I've got bad guys, all the ninjas. Never actually watched Ninjago. I've probably seen like a couple of little episodes if the kids have got it on in the background. So I couldn't tell you who any of them are. But that is all the minifigures, which are AliExpress style. And I had about 500 of them. And then I've still got some which I'm keeping, so I'm going to show you them now. So I've got a drawer full of Marvel figures. So I've got random goodies. I've got mixed bits that have got to go with them. Box of Iron Man. You've got some war machines or something in there. Giant figs, baddies. X-Men, Spider-Man, uh, that's all full of baddies. That's all, another pot full of random, do you know what I mean? So I've got loads of Marvel figures, which I've got to dish around. Then in here we've, well that's Marvel, so I've put that in the wrong place. In here we've got 
horses, animals, Toy Story, we've got a load of DC characters, uh, Toy Story characters, Minecraft characters, friends and minifigs. <coughs> Down there I've got my big cars, nowhere to put those at the moment. Uh, this is road base plates and tracks. Then in here, if you can see the black plate on the bottom, these are ones that a majority have come from here. We got Pikachu with Ash Ketchum. We got some random Marvel figures that are duplicates, which I've moved over. I mean, we a lot of the figures that I've kept, which aren't multiples, like some Ninjagos and stuff like that, we're going to mix them up and kind of create new characters out of them. Uh, what have we got? Well, this guy's headless, but he's got a quiver on his back and a crossbow. The snake. What else have we got? We've got Dragon Ball Z characters. I think they were called Ewoks or something. Again, Marvel. We've got Friends. I think that was supposed to be Princess Leia or something. I don't know. But again, oh, yeah, we got James. Which means somewhere in here we've also got Jesse. We've got the cheesy, like, Pokemon-type characters. So there are absolutely hundreds in here that we can create. I mean, we've got... Spider-Man that we can make like spider fan people, you know what I mean? Uh, I have no idea what the hell these guys are, but I've got a few of these. So I've got to kind of make something to do with them. Uh, Stormtroopers, Bounty Hunters, Ninjago. So as I say, we've got a whole drawer full of random. And then this is all figure parts. So what's in here? Basketball bike. Oh, I've been looking for some of these. Oh, okay. Right, so that can stay out. Skeletons. Oh, this is all Squid Games characters. So that can go in the random drawer. All accessories which I haven't sorted and put away. Bodies, legs, hats, hairs, masks, helmets. A few more random characters. Again, capes and stuff like that that's all over there. Oh, we got a big shark head and a unicorn head. We've got some dogs. So, yeah, we've got plenty of stuff to make some more characters. The kids love joining in with that. So that is something I'm going to get on to as well. As I say, I've been looking for some of these parts. So now that i found them, look, I've got, like, my candy floss machine, a skateboard police bike sweet so i'm gonna have a play with that as well now this is what was in that random bag so i've got a mock lawnmower i'm guessing that was supposed to be a candy machine or a snow machine or something i'm not sure I've got the police bike some hair some swords helmets a guitar skateboards and a wicked little push chair as well now this is a cool little find we got some Bringles. I don't even know where I've got that from. Look at my awesome little lawnmower. Okay, so here we are a bit later. And I have added a whole bunch of minifigures. So for now, they're just kind of placed. Just to kind of fill in the gaps. We got a couple of little stories going on, you know, like waiting in a queue, having something to eat, having a chat. We got a couple of fight scenes ready to burst. I've kind of dotted them here, there, and everywhere that I've got some space. This area I haven't finished tiling yet or deciding what I'm doing with it, so of course I haven't done much there. Got people at the bus stops, everybody in cars, people on bikes. 
Got a little meeting going on here with somebody taking photos outside Avengers Tower. Again, you know, I've tried to put where I've got the tiles, I've got a few bits here. Kind of fills it in a bit and all down the paths that are there. Coming down the side of the building. We've got pathways full of people. Queues at vans. Princesses chatting. People walking around the pond. More around the skate park, the basketball court. Outside the aquarium. KFC. McDonald's. Got the shop, Marge going into the shop. Hey, uh, we've got Santa going into the pet shop to look for some more reindeers. Got Loki going up in the sneaky bit. Queue for the rides coming in and out. Again, we've got people at the market, so everything's looking a bit better here. A couple of fight scenes. Ash is ready to face off against Team Rocket. Raccoon going through the bin. So yeah, I even got a couple of people. There's Harry Potter. A couple of people dotted up and around. Uh, what else have we got? We've got a couple of people on the roofs. Uh, where else have we got one? We've got one there. Electro up there. Corbius Moore up there, I think it is. I put Yoda there. You know, just to kind of dot it around a bit. And then obviously the car park's a bit busy as well. So yeah, slowly but surely coming to it. And then with these buildings here, I've added some minifigures into here as well. Just to kind of add to it a bit. Shops are looking busy, hairdressers is looking busy, ninja meeting on top, Dobby hiding out the back of the store. So yeah, slowly but surely, we are coming along. We have some minifigures in. I've got to do another train station there, build some train ram things to stop it from falling off the edge. But other than that, we are done did. Well, that's definitely put a dent on the random figures. Well, I haven't even started on the DC, the Marvel or anything else yet. Right, so that's everything for this video. This one, we've got people added. We've got a train station. We've got man cave. We've got people on bikes and cars. I've changed the school and everything around so it looks a bit more full here. So, yeah. We are getting there, there's still a lot of progress to be made, but we're making the most of it. Good thing about a Lego City is you are never finished. Even when all this is done and filled, eventually I'll be changing bits, I'll be stripping bits, I'll be rebuilding, adding buildings, improving buildings. So again, never, never ends. Plenty to do with the Lego City. So... Welcome to Man Cave City. And I'll see you in the next video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell. Bye-bye.